because we were telling we were talking outside about how she was crying and what did you say oh yeah so what i said was a woman's tears are only legit when she cries by herself when she's crying in front of other people nine out of ten times is to garner some type of emotion or get some type of reaction out of you for her favor because you got to remember that women are physically inferior to men so they have to use emotional manipulation to get you to do things. They make you feel bad. She oh my is God. Extremely, extremely manipulative. Yeah, that's what that's the, that's their power, bro, is being able to manipulate you through emotions and them crying and stuff like that. But the reality is that 99% of the times, when they're crying in front of people, it's not legit. They get the crocodile tears to make you feel bad. No, no, you gotta understand. She was crying and then she went outside and she was like sobbing, like sobbing, screaming, like, ah! Yeah. Ah! She was like, yeah, bro, it's all for attention. And like I said before... No, I think she's genuine, though. No. Absolutely not. You gotta understand, no girl's ever, like, done what she did for me. She was going with me, like, we went to Vegas, L.A., like, it was such a good time. Ask yourself this. If you weren't Neon, would she still fuck with you? I don't know. The answer's no. A profound no. You know for a fact? You haven't even met her. She's the OnlyFans, bro. And she's an influencer. That's all I need to know. Damn. Unfortunately. So now what? And here's the thing, like I get it, like that's what girls do, like their job is to come in and extract resources from men, but I mean bro, don't commit to girls that are on OnlyFans, bro, or OnlyFans, this recreational use only. I'm not saying not to deal with them, but you just don't take them seriously. You don't give them no What? I didn't I'm a virgin. I swear to God, wallahi. No, that's fine that you're a virgin, but like, bro, you you hung out with the OF. Bro? Oh, she's texting me. Oh, she's calling me. She ain't a fucking liar. I swear to God, she is. Did you get married to talk to her? No, no, you don't want to. Bro, she, bro I don't need to talk. To, she had three or four, man. Tell her the truth. That, that, what? That's not. Why is she shit. calling you? This is awkward. All right, don't it's answer. Not gonna, uh, nah, man. Right. I don't want to put you in a weird position. No, no, no. Well, dude, I mean, like, again, I'm giving you the advice. She's going to try to sit here and be like, no, he's an asshole. He's a misogynist, blah, blah, blah. You're but not a misogynist. Reality, you seem like an actual genuine good Muslim. I'm realistic. I'm not, like, girls say I'm misogynistic. No, I'm realistic. If girls make certain decisions, they no longer qualify for a relationship. If a girl wants to do sex work, congratulations. You are recreational. But on OnlyFans, she doesn't show anything. doesn't matter. She just does IG shit. Like, you know, like. It doesn't matter. She sexualizes herself for money. That's the worst type of girl. I'm going to be honest, though, bro. Look at me, bro. I'm not going to find a normal girl like that likes me. Well, that's why you got to self-improve. Yeah. You got to get in the gym. You got to understand uh, how she's women spamming. think. Oh, my God. Yeah, of course she's spamming you. Damn. Of course she's spamming you. I, I shouldn't answer, right? Nah, man. Ignore her, bro. She's probably, like, in her room screaming, like, fuck this ignore kid. Her, man. Bro, you guys were seeing each other, and she fucked somebody else? Um, according to the lie detector. She probably was. Or if she didn't fuck somebody else, she was definitely talking to other people. I don't think so. I'm gonna be honest, right? When I look her in the eyes, it's genuine, bro. She's a genuine person. I'm, like I could tell, bro. Like you're you're genuine. He's not, you know. What the fuck? Okay, okay. I should, well, I'll him. You know, I love you. You're my brother. Bro. Look, bro. You gotta understand that girl game is selling you purity. That's what girls do. They sell you purity. I'm a good girl. I'm an angel. I don't do that. She blah, told blah, blah. me she's celibate for a year. <laughs> That's not true, bro. A girl's never not fucking somebody, bro. I believed it. On God, I believed it. No. So basically, I'm just a fucking She's, retard. Yes, you're you're a retard. But it's okay. You're 19. You don't know better. That's why it's a very important to get experience with girls so you can figure out the Decepticons. Okay, but tonight we're going to a bunch of whores too. So is that not the option? What do you mean? Like we're gonna we're gonna uh, the Nelk people uh, set up for me and Sneeko. Great. But I want to find a real girl that I could, you know, like love and bring on stream. Bro, look, man, I told Sneeko this. Assume every girl's a whore unless she proves otherwise. So talk to them off camera. But they're not going to talk to me. Dude, I went to an L.A. party. Everyone was crowded around to get uh, up on me. I swear to God, if I didn't have a camera or anything, I would be sitting in a corner by myself. Well, that's where you got to learn how to, you know, have real conversations and not necessarily do it for the, the stream, man. Yeah. At least if you want girls to take you seriously. Because they're looking at it like it's a come up. Uh, she keeps calling me. Good. Let her keep calling. Ignore that bitch. He doesn't block when he gets spam calls. He doesn't block them for some reason. Yeah, bro. You gotta, you gotta have a backbone with these girls, man. All right, you need to call her a bitch, though. Huh? Fuck bro, she's you, on bitch. OnlyFans. 
right, you're right. Bro, she's on OF. You're right. All right like, so that's all I need to know. Like, bro, she sexualized herself for money. It's an L. Off rip. That's an L. L. Recreational use back? only. Did she ever come back from OnlyFans? Not really, bro. No. Not really. What if she quits for me? If she quits it all, quits OF, deletes it. When a girl's of a mindset where I'm going to sexualize myself for money, bro, then the, 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 the sign's fucked up here. I think I need to find an Indian girl. But they're fucking ugly, dude. Like, Find a, go get yourself a Egyptian girl. Or a chick from the uh, Middle East somewhere. And then just bring them here? Nah, you're going to have to keep them over there. Because the West will corrupt them. So what do I do, bro? What, what, oh, I'm so confused, man. Like, what, just, what, just kill myself, dude? Like, <laughs> No, you just got to understand female nature, man. You just got to know how girls really move, how they operate. You're young, so you're, you're figuring it out. That, you know, that's the first girl I've ever talked to. That's yeah. the first girl I've ever talked to in my entire life. Yeah, so she has the advantage. And I got she attached. Knows, I'm going to be honest. More, I, was, yeah. I was having dreams about her. I was daydreaming about her. It was bad, bro. Yeah, I know. I know. That's what girls do. Like, they, they prey on guys like you that don't know their worth. So what's my worth? What do you think? Well... You're a famous guy, probably doing well for yourself financially, um, but you don't understand your value. And girl game is you not understanding your value and manipulating you into thinking that they're, you know, they have more leverage over you. And that's what happens when girls have experience over you. The reality is you have the leverage, but you're behaving like she has the leverage.